Christmas has always been very, very important to the family because sa dad ko, you know, next to God, family was always uh, number one. No? So, my dad grew up in an age, the 60s, 70s, that you really work very hard. So, net effect sa amin nun is that sa special holidays lang namin talaga siya nasosolo. No? And he made sure that during Christmas, um, the family ang number one sa kanya. May mga traditions kaming nabuo with my dad mm -hmm. na until now ginagawa namin. Like what? Um, sa 24, we all gather in one house. Tapos ang ginagawa ng dad ko noon, open sa friends niya. Okay. No? So hanggang 12 yon. Some will go uh, in and out, mag, uh, magsisimba. And then hanggang 12 o'clock. <clears throat> then at 12, we say a prayer. Then nag-open kami ng presents together. So, dala na rin namin yung presents, no? no? Then, nagdi-disperse uh, to meet yung mga in-laws, etc. Mm -hmm. for lunch. Uh, kung sino natira doon, will take my mom out for lunch. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, sa gabi, Christmas uh, dinner naman namin. You as a gift giver? Um, sa amin, we were brought up kasi na my dad was generous, pero may timing. So, meaning, okay. all throughout the year, hindi ka pwedeng bumili unless need. So, sabi mo, kailangan mo ng maong, kailangan mo pakita na Sirani. nasira na yung baog, you know. But Christmas season, um, talagang giving. We were really taught na it's not the price, but to give something, you know. And then, my, ma my mom's a teacher, a kindergarten teacher. So, she's very artistic. And then, very creative. So, like, one Christmas, sabi niya, oh, uh, we'll make stockings, okay. you know. And although walang fireplace sa Pilipinas, ilagay natin to sa sala natin. So, kung ano stocking, pupunuin ko. So, sa, kala ko makakaisa ako. So, kumuha ko ng sako, then gumupit lang ako ng kartulina na iba't bang kulay. Yun ang ginawa kong giant stocking, di ba? So, sabi ko, ako na pinakamaraming regalo this Christmas kasi... Uh, siguro, 12, 13, 14, di ba? So, sabi ko, lamang na ako dito. No? And my mom, I forgot that whatever I know, my mom knows more. So, when we woke up, I rushed to the sala where our Christmas tree is. Mm -hmm. no? Doon din yung bar namin. Tapos doon kami nag-Christmas nag uh, Eve or doon yeah. kami nag-dinner ng pamilya. No? Pagtingin ko, ano, puno nga siya. Pero, una nang nilagay ng mom ko. Giant na una. So, puno na kaagad. Pero siguro, naawa din. So, naglagay din siya ng isang supot ng chocolates, di ba? And a couple of things. Wow. Okay. If you were given like three wishes now, what would your wishes be? Well, Christmas. syempre, all of us wish for good health sa ating parents at saka mga kamag-anak kasi we want them to enjoy life more, di ba? Uh, number two, kahit ano sabihin mo, time din, di ba? Kasi, you know, we, we, in public service, um, it's a calling. Eh? It, it's it's not that you have to be with people, you have to go to their affairs, but minsan ang request lang naman nila, nandung ka sa party, nandung ka sa lamay, nila, um, you're there kung may problema sila or may okasyon. So, so minsan, mahirap kumanap ng time na sama-sama kami. So really, time to be with the family and everything. no. <clears throat> and then, um, you know, it's, it's also for the country, di ba? Kasi you cannot wish na okay kayong pamilya, okay yung community mo because we're a subset eh, of, a, of a greater community and the better the community, the better everyone is. So I think that's one of our wishes then, di ba? Na parang our country finds its place in the world, finds its identity. No, I mean, the way that... Well, my wife and I really want to have a baby, and we've been trying for two years. No, so the doctor just told us to rest lang <clears throat> for a while and relax. <clears throat> Sabi niya baka stress lang kasi physically wala naman daw. Mm -hmm. If ever, if you given the choice, boy or girl, if you want. It does, well, we want twins. If if we had the choice, whether twin boys, twin girls, or isang boy, isang girl, pero we we'd, we'd like to have twins para dalawa na kaagad.